Well, the city of Wabasha is teaming up with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers to manage dredged sand from the Mississippi River. This partnership between a local government and a federal government agency is one of a kind. Our Eric Min talked with Corps and Wabasha officials today. And so, Eric, what are uh, they doing with all this sand? Tom, officials hope to use the sand in a number of different ways, including construction and agricultural projects in the Wabasha area. This agreement for dread sand management between the Wabasha and the Army Corps was years in the making. Monday morning was a historic day for Wabasha as trucks moved piles of dredged sand near the Mississippi River. The small city is teaming up with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers in cleaning the waterway by helping to manage the dredged materials removed from the river. This management agreement by the city of Wabasha and the Army Corps is one of a kind. It allows the Corps and the city to work together um, in managing what could have been a big problem for the city. Uh, this is the first time that it's, this agreement's used on the river. It's the first time it's used in the interior of the United States. It's only been used a few times in other parts of the country, so it's kind of a model for what could possibly happen for other communities in the future. According to the Army Corps, about a quarter of the one million cubic yards of sand that the St. Paul District removes from the Mississippi annually actually comes from the Wabashar community. Wabashar Mayor Emily Duran says this is a win not only for the Army Corps and City of Wabashar, but also the community. There's a significant amount of freight that's moved along the Mississippi and that cost of moving that freight as well as the ability to move it on the river versus on our highways, it, it affects everybody. It affects everybody. So it affects farmers, it affects the entire region, it affects the, the food chain. Both Mayor Duran and Port Authority President John Fried Meyer say they are delighted about this partnership. It was nice that, that a federal organization, an entity such as the Army Corps, really came to the table and became partners with us into what could have been a big problem for the city became a huge opportunity. Mayor Duran also says the Mississippi River is an important commercial corridor and a primary blood vessel of this part of the region. She says as a small city on the waterway, it is important for her and the community to cooperate with the officials for the longevity of the river. Live in the studio, Eric Min, K2DC News.